He was full of life. He would help anyone and everyone. A plate of his favorite cookies. Our mom taught us to make them when we were kids. Sits beside a photograph of a war hero. He loved serving his country. He was proud of his service. Stacy Pollock fondly remembers her brother, Army Officer Robert Gooch. He was looking forward to his retirement and spending time with his kids um, and just kind of being a stay-at-home dad. A 34-year-old father who survived deployments overseas did not survive a January 8th trip to this Chesterfield Wawa. That it was completely so random. And that of all the people. Monday, a judge found George Bushman not guilty by reason of insanity. His family says the 35-year-old has battled mental illness all his life and believed Gooch wanted to harm his own daughter, who was with him at the time of the fatal shooting. To this day, he believes that he, he removed a threat. That's, that's a delusion he's still under. Pollock says this not guilty verdict was hard to stomach. It's hard to process, right, because it doesn't feel like justice but says she hopes the man charged with killing her brother gets the help he needs. Um, it feels like there might not be closure the way we wanted it. From our family, we don't wish ill will on him or his family. We don't want revenge. We, we weren't like, oh, he has to die. He took a life. Like, we just want to make sure that he's in a position where he can't hurt anybody else again. And the victim's family tells me they even met with the suspect's family er earlier this year. They laughed, and talked, and cried. The victim is uh, survived by his wife, his fiance, rather, and three young children. Working for you in Chesterfield, I'm Brennan King, CBS 6 News.